I assume you saw Dad's new girlfriend. I'm so glad to have you back. I hope it works out so you can stay. And I'm sorry, I meant to tell you about Rachel. When did she move in? A month ago. She's helping him cope three times a night. Not including the beginning, the overall plot, and the ending, there are a few things that really don't make sense about the uninvited. One, the title, who is uninvited, who is invited. There don't seem to be any invitations present or absent anywhere. Anyway, even stranger is the presence of Elizabeth Banks, a talented and versatile actress who managed to appear as the first lady and a porn star in W and Zack and Mary Make a Porno, respectively, in a two-week span last year. Banks is way too good for rubbish like The Uninvited, in which she plays the not-very-nice new girlfriend to a man played by David Strathairn, whose wife recently died in a fire and whose daughters are convinced Banks sparked the flame. We know everything. You caught me. Here. <laughs> the movie is a remake of the 2003 Korean horror flick A Tale of Two Sisters, but would feel lame and familiar even if it weren't. No scares, no logic, no point. The bonus is the straightforward approach of the horny teen who doesn't even pause when telling a girl, I love you and I have a condo. Gotta at least appreciate someone whose intentions are honest and have safety in mind. For Metromix, I'm Matt Pace.